Hey, how's it going, guys? Uh, my name is Dework. I am the uh, host of this channel right here. This is my Discord. And we've been doing a lot of Jackbox games together, and it's been a blast. So first off, I'm going to quickly shout out my stream, uh, twitch.tv slash dework. It's going to be in the description below, along with the link to my Discord. Uh, so you can hopefully play some Jackbox games with us. But uh, I'm just going to get into it and tell you guys how I am hosting games currently on my Discord and why I think this is a better method than I am seeing a lot of Twitch streamers doing on Twitch right now. Um, so I've had the pleasure to not only host my own games, but to join other Twitch streamers uh, to be uh, playing Jackbox games during this quarantine. And I thought, hey, might be a good idea to share my uh, method. That way, you guys, if you want to host these games yourself, you're going to have a quick and easy way to do that. So I see a lot of people using different uh, video call services like uh, Zoom, which is typically like for conference calls. But uh, people have been using Jackbox games for that. That is awesome. But... Honestly, not a whole lot of people are going to want to hop onto that because either you have to make a new account, download something else. Uh, maybe you don't want to be in front of other people with a camera. Uh, I'm not entirely sure if you can do just a voice chat. But anyway, all that being said, Discord is already set up for gamers. And I feel like this is just a quick and easy way uh, to put people in a voice chat to be able to talk to one another. Because I've noticed for one but or uh, for a few games in particular, voice chat is really important. Push a button, for example, has one of, uh, oh man, is it called the cryo chamber? Uh, one of the functions of the game in order to detect if someone is an alien, you really need to communicate some uh, different type of alien, you know, language shapes kind of a thing. And you have to describe the shape in depth. And if you don't have voice, eh, it's going to be a mess. Um, so anyway, I found that this is the best way to do it. Um, so there's no one in my discord right now because <laughs> it's almost four in the morning. Uh, we hosted games earlier today, so, uh, I'm just gonna show you what I would do. Um, here, let me minimize this so you can see it on the side. So first things first, you want to boot up your game. So, uh, here I got party pack four. Let's just boot up party pack four for the heck of it. Why not? So as it's starting up. You have a pull up right here. I'm going to pull up the Discord. So as you can see, it's running in the background. And right here, I have a button on my Discord channel. When you're in your Discord channel, uh, this is another tip. You have to have your own server. You can't like uh, you could probably do it in another server if you have the permissions, but not not every channel gives you the permission. So it might be easier if you just make your own server with some voice channels. Uh, you might, can look up some other videos how to do that. Because but that's going to be the most effective solution. So if you have your own uh, Discord server already, it's going to be really easy. You just make people jump into a voice channel. So uh, let me here. We got the Jackbox Games channel. People are going to jump into that. Say you got like, you know, six or seven or however many people. And then you're going to hit that stream button. And this is going to stream um, a live feed of whatever you want. So I have a few different things here. Let's select the Jackbox Party Pack for it because that's the game that we are streaming and hit go live. And it's going to give people a live feed of this in full screen, as you can see right here. And uh, since I'm the host, I just have to focus on the game right here. Um, I don't have to focus on um, the what I'm streaming. But other people will see the game fed live and that's going to give no delay because i see a lot of people playing with their twitch viewers and there's a bit of a delay so for some games it's like there's a slight disadvantage because there's a few second window where the viewers get less time to answer questions so i feel like this is the most simple solution uh to allow for everyone to play so that's pretty much it guys as we enjoy some really good music i didn't i didn't plan to do this but we're, we're doing it we're just vibing so if you guys want to join my discord server and play with us oh, this is loud i'm just gonna just gonna chill out with that for a second if you want to play with us feel free to join my discord and uh hop in the jackbox games chat and even if i'm not hosting any games uh, potentially, I, I know a few of the guys in our Discord already have their own Jackbox games, and we could probably figure out how to get them to host some games as well, or you yourself could probably host some games in my Discord. And uh, this is just going to be a, hopefully a really good place during this uh, COVID outbreak to be able to bring people together. Um, it's been a blast so far. We've been having a lot of fun. Uh, and yeah, maybe make some new friends in the process. 
So hopefully this is a good uh, concise video to help you guys host your Jackbox games on Discord and it's going to be a much better platform in my opinion than uh, some of the other options that are out there. So this is my favorite so far and I hope you enjoyed the video. Have a great day guys and hope to catch you around in my Discord.